As we've discussed in earlier modules, data is brought into your note in a variety of ways. Smart templates built directly into the note automatically populate data upon opening the note. Autotext, however, is a feature that is controlled directly by you, the author of the note. There are two types of autotext. The first type is a system-wide autotext, which consists of multiple smart templates built directly into the system. These are designed to pull specific data from the patient's record at your discretion. To access the available list, you must type the plus sign or shift plus. The second type of autotext is created by you and is only accessed under your login. Examples would be your own physical exam or a description of an operative procedure. To access your own specific list of auto text, a designated character is used, such as an upward arrow or shift six on your keyboard. We will now go through the steps necessary to pull system-wide auto text into your note. We will continue working in the medical admission, history and physical already opened in Module 2. This template has been built to include most recent lab results. You know there was also a pregnancy test done and wish to include that in your note. Place your cursor in the lab section and type the plus sign or shift plus. The list of system-wide auto text will open. Double click on plus lab pregnancy tests and the results will drop into your note. Next, we will go through the steps necessary to create personal auto text. Unlike system-wide auto text, personal auto text will only be available under your own login. There are multiple ways to create personal auto text. The auto text tool allows you to type or dictate directly into the add text box. If you already have documented text you would like to use in other notes, you can use copy and paste functionality in creating your auto text. As an example, let's create a personal auto text using the negative review of systems found in our medical admission history and physical. Start by copying the text. Left click and highlight from constitutional through agitation. Right click and copy. Go to the template toolbar and click on the auto text icon found on the right. Once the auto text tool opens, click on the new phrase icon. Your cursor will be found in the abbreviation field. Your auto text abbreviation should start with a designated character. Do not choose the plus sign as this is already used with system-wide auto text. Choose a character rarely used in documentation. The same character can be used by multiple users because your personal auto text will only be available under your login. We will use the upward arrow or shift six. Follow your character with an abbreviation for your auto text that will be easily identified by you when opening your list. We will use ROS. Move to the description field where you can type in a full description of your auto text. In this field, we will type in review of systems. Next, Click on the Add Text icon to open the Auto Text Entry box. Make sure your cursor is placed in the lower field designated for dynamic documentation. Right click and paste. Your negative review of systems will appear. At this point, you may make changes or revisions to the text. Once ready to save, click OK, click Save, and Close. Please note, auto text creation can be done without copied text. Once in the auto text entry box, you can type or dictate your auto text. Revisions to an existing auto text 
can also be done here. Now that we have demonstrated how to create a personal auto text, let's add our saved auto text for review of systems into our note. To demonstrate, we must first remove the existing review of systems from our template using the small x in the right hand side of the section. Place your cursor in the blank space under the Review of Systems heading and hit Shift-6 on your keyboard. Double click on ROS in the Auto Text list and the saved Review of Systems will drop in. This concludes our module on Auto Text.